Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math. Today we're learning about how to simplify variable expressions with a square root. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem here. Simplify the negative square root of 81 times y squared. And we usually have to ask ourselves this question. What squared is equal to what's on the inside of the square root, 81y squared. So let's break this down. What squared gives me that 81y squared? Let's deal with the 81. 81 comes first. We're multiplying it by the y squared. Well, what squared gives me 81? And that's a 9. 9 squared is 81. So we have a 9 here times now we're dealing, so we have the 81 came down times, we're dealing with the y squared now. What gives us a y squared? And that's just going to be a y, right? A y squared on the outside gives us the y squared here. <coughs> and so the inside, excuse me, is just a 9y. So if we want to simplify this, the negative stays on the outside, and then if we take the square root of 81y squared, that's equivalent to a 9y, and there we have it. Negative square root of 81, y squared, simplifies to be a negative 9y. I hope you learned something here on how to simplify variable expressions with square root. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.